The Indian railway system is awaiting a big transformation, and it's already underway. A groundbreaking project based on Japan's Shinkansen. Despite facing challenges, including political resistance and pandemic-related delays, the construction is gaining momentum, with Surat being one of the 12 stops on the 508-kilometer mumbai Ahmedabad route. In the heart of India, Surat is gearing up for a groundbreaking transformation, the country's first bullet train, from political roadblocks to pandemic challenges. Join us on a brief exploration of India's journey, from the challenges of an aging rail infrastructure to the ambitious dream of a nationwide high-speed network. India boasts one of the world's oldest rail networks, with a legacy spanning over 160 years. However, despite its historical significance, the rail system grapples with challenges such as slow trains, overcrowding, aging infrastructure, and safety concerns. As the nation with the fastest-growing major economy, India faces the imperative of modernizing its rail network to meet the demands of a rapidly evolving society. As India's economic hubs burgeon, the necessity for efficient and high-speed connectivity becomes increasingly apparent. The existing railway infrastructure, though extensive, struggles to keep pace with the demands of a nation surpassing China's population. With over 12 million daily commuters and a rail network that moves billions of tons of freight annually, the inadequacies of the current system underscore the urgency for a transformative solution. Aiming to leapfrog into the future, India embarks on its first high-speed rail project, drawing inspiration from Japan's iconic Shinkansen system. The Mumbai-Ahmedabad route, covering a distance of over 500 kilometers, is a testament to India's ambition to join the League of Nations with advanced rail networks. The collaboration with Japan extends beyond technology transfer, encompassing funding, training, and shared expertise. Did you know? Japan is the one who is mostly paying for the construction, about $12.78 billion. The total project costs $19 billion. The Mumbai Ahmedabad route presents a myriad of engineering challenges, from elevated viaducts to a groundbreaking undersea tunnel. Approximately 92% of the track will traverse elevated viaducts and bridges, allowing for seamless integration with existing infrastructure and minimizing environmental impact. However, the Thane Creek poses a unique challenge, leading to the decision to construct India's first undersea rail tunnel. This engineering feat, though groundbreaking, has contributed to delays, pushing the completion date beyond the initial projections. While the Mumbai Ahmedabad bullet train project represents a significant stride towards modernization, it has not been devoid of setbacks. Land acquisition, a perennial challenge in large infrastructure projects, faced obstacles in Maharashtra, with legal disputes impeding progress. A change in the state government further complicated matters, raising questions about the prioritization of the bullet train project over other infrastructural needs. Japan's involvement in the project extends beyond technological support. With loans exceeding $4.5 billion provided since 2017, Japan emerged as a crucial financial partner. The collaborative approach involves Japanese assistance in training Indian workers, ensuring knowledge transfer, and fostering a symbiotic relationship that extends beyond the completion of the project. This partnership highlights the importance of shared expertise in navigating complex infrastructure initiatives. As of the latest updates, the Mumbai Ahmedabad bullet train project has progressed by over 26%, with the Gujarat leg leading the way at 32.93% completion. Despite initial delays, a renewed momentum is evident, attributed to a change in government in Maharashtra and concerted efforts to expedite land acquisition. The project's completion is now projected for August 2026, with an expanded section expected to be operational by 2027. Beyond the engineering marvels and logistical intricacies, the bullet train project holds profound socio-economic implications. The improved connectivity between Mumbai and Ahmedabad, two economic powerhouses, is expected to catalyze regional development. The potential reduction in travel time from nine hours to under three hours could stimulate economic activities and job creation and foster a more integrated and accessible transportation network. While the bullet train project signifies a significant leap forward, it is not immune to criticism and debate extends to whether the substantial investment in the bullet train will yield commensurate returns and if the focus should be on enhancing the current railway infrastructure. The Mumbai Ahmedabad project is envisioned as the precursor to a nationwide high-speed rail network, connecting major cities and fostering seamless travel across the subcontinent. 
Feasibility studies have been conducted for potential routes linking Mumbai to New Delhi, Mumbai to Chennai, and New Delhi to Kolkata. The transformative potential of high-speed rail in propelling India into the echelons of global economic power is palpable, but challenges persist.